Hey, I'm Blake, and welcome back to another episode of Blake's Takes. Corvette tips straight from the shop here at CNS Corvettes. Today's take is why premium fuel is so important for your Corvette. There are a lot of myths that float around about Octane. In this episode, we'll cover what it actually does and why GM specifies premium fuel for your Corvette and what happens if you run regular fuel what octane really is when people hear the word octane they think usually a stronger gas or a gas with more power that's not true octane doesn't measure energy it measures stability premium fuel is more resistant to knock or what's sometimes called pinging knock and pinging happens when the air fuel mixture ignites unevenly and creates multiple flame fronts that collide inside the cylinder so instead of one smooth controlled burn, you get chaotic mini bursts fighting each other. And that makes the pinging sound and it puts stress on pistons, valves, rings, and bearings. So when you see the various octane choices at your local gas pump, those numbers are telling you how resistant that fuel is to knock. It's not horsepower in a can, it's protection against uncontrolled combustion. That protection is critical and a high performance engine that's in your Corvette. Why knock matters? Knock matters because those uncontrolled bursts don't just make noise. They create harsh pressure waves that beat up the internals of your engine. Over time, that pounding can chip piston edges, damage rings, pound bearings, and weaken valves. Performance engines like the LS and the LT V8s and Corvettes run higher compression ratio and a more aggressive ignition timing to make fuel efficiently. Those make them strong performers, but more sensitive to knock. That's why GM just doesn't recommend premium fuel, it's required. So how does your Corvette react on regular gas? Your Corvette's pretty smart. It's got sensors always listening for that knock or pinging. The second it hears it, it tells the computer and it pulls back timing and it pulls the power to protect the engine. Here's what that means. Your Corvette can run on 87, 89 octane, but it won't perform as it should. The computer basically pulls the spark advance and makes the engine run weaker so it does not hurt itself. Around town, you may not notice, but as you hit the gas, you'll feel the car holding back. That's the best case scenario. If you keep using regular fuel, those repeated little chaotic burns build up over time. Even the computer protecting it, your pistons, valves, cylinders are all still taking a beating. So yes, it'll run, but should you? Absolutely not. Premium fuel is not an option. They mean it. That's the bare minimum that your Corvette was designed to run on. Think about this. You're only saving between eight to twelve dollars between a lower grade octane fuel and a higher grade octane fuel but yet you're risking a very large repair bill in the future if you continue to use the regular fuel if you're somewhere and they only have the lower octane fuel that's fine to do it once but try to get to somewhere where you can get a higher octane to mix it in to bring it back up because you will start to see problems and don't forget if you're running regular octane fuel you're leaving horsepower on the table that's performance you paid for. You should use it. So here's the truth. The premium fuel doesn't magically add horsepower. It helps keep your engine safe while letting the Corvette run the timing and compression it was designed for. For your Corvette, premium fuel is not an option. It's the rule. And following that rule keeps your engine strong for years to come. Well, that's it for this episode of Blake Stakes what octane actually is. When people hear the word octane, they think usually a stronger gas or, uh, take a look at this real quick. <laughs> Resistant, that's the word I can't get in my head, yeah. Premium fuel is more resistant to knock. That's all I remembered. <laughs> <laughs> Instead of one smooth burn, you get a, nope. Performance engines like the LS and the LT V8s that are in the Corvettes run a higher compression and a more aggressive timing, uh, ignition timing, nope. So if you think about it, 
filling up with regular octane versus higher octane, you're only saving about eight to $12 per fill up. And that's risking a large, nope, gotta do it again. So think about it this way. You're only saving between eight to $12 using regular fuel instead of 93 octane. Nope. So think about this. You're only spending, <laughs> think about this. You're only saving between eight to $12 between regular octane or a higher octane fuel but yet you're risking a very large repair view. I had it, I had it. Think about this. Stop nodding your head. Every time I start talking, you just start nodding your head and I'm like, he's agreeing with what I'm saying. <laughs> and don't forget, if you're running a lower octane fuel, you're leaving horsepower on the table, man. Uh, you paid for that. Nope, we gotta run that one back. <laughs> You're leaving horsepower on the table, man. Man, I can't say man. So the bottom line, the truth is, nope. Why? I see that's where that messed me up on that. All right, I'm not what? with your friends. Friends with your friends. If you like, share, subscribe with your friends. Your Corvette friends. Corvette buddy. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and tell me down in the comments below if you've ever seen what has happened to a Corvette that has run on regular octane fuel. Thanks again for watching. I'll see you next time.